What's up? It's Esteban hanging out with J. Cole. Uh, How you living, man? I'm good, brother. Blessed. Happy. Just turning the album. Feeling Word. Great. Yeah. Now, Born Center, thing. you just turned it in yeah. this week. Yeah, 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 yeah. How does just, it feel? Are you, was it reluctant? Were you easy let go? What's up? No, no, no. I'm like a perfectionist. So even when I got the masters back, which is supposed to be the final, I was like, nah, we got to change this. You know what I mean? Like, I hear this. And so we was going back and forth. So like, even when I thought I was done, like I took a trip to Miami for like two days, like, yo, we turning the album, only to come right back and be like, nah, we gotta change some stuff. You <laughs> know what I mean? So like, that's just how I am, so. But I thought I would feel relieved, and I do like musically, that side is over. Like I'm not worried about like making songs no more, cause it's just, it's done. But now in terms of like promo and like, you know, taking on Kanye West right now, so it's a big, you know, it's a big yes. deal. Yeah. Let's talk about that. You pushed the album up to June 18th. Now, normally, artists are like trying to avoid competing with other big artists because exactly. they want that number one week. Exactly. So why would you push it up? <clears throat> yeah, because you know, that's just how I am, man. It's like, you know, it, it wasn't even a second thought that when the idea hit me, because there was rumors, like he tweeted June 18th, and I knew my album was coming June 25th. I had already put out the date. At first, I didn't think nothing about it. I was like, oh, he coming, I'm, I'm good. Like, I know what I got, I'm right. straight. But, but then when it got a little more real, and I realized he really was coming on the 18th, I was like, yo, you know what? Nah, it was like an immediate light bulb went off. It's like, nah, I'm going to see him. You know what I mean? Wow. Like, I'm going to his date. Like, I'm not going to sit in the shadows of a Kanye West album. Nah, I'm coming and making you make a decision. Like, you know, you can, you might love both, but I know what I got, and I'm coming on that date. You know what I mean? That's big, man. It worked. Gotta yeah. applaud that. It worked, yeah. Now, something <laughs> that's crazy, by the way. It is. Like, it's wild, but you know. It's just, it is what it is. I think, I honestly feel like a lot of your fans are Kanye fans. Yeah, of course. It, I'm a Kanye the fan. Same. That's the wild thing. Say no more. I'm a Kanye fan. This isn't like when uh, when Kanye and 50, it's right. kind of like that, but like they both came in at the same time. You know what right. I mean? So they were kind of competitive in a sense. With me, it's like, I, mean, I was at SOBs watching Kanye West. I was 18 years old. Wow. You know what I mean? This is like Kobe Jordan, rather, or like LeBron Kobe. This is like the young kid coming in like, yo, I can play too. You know what I'm saying? That's what's up. Yeah. 